To create the plain seam sewing sample, what you're going to do is take two four by eight pieces of fabric. You will lay them on the table, close them like a book, just like we did in patchwork, and then match up the sides. These are raw edges. They're the edges of fabric that is cut by scissors. And what we're going to do is take our pins and put raw edges together with our pretty sides or right sides facing each other. Insert the pin down and then up. Move your thumb over. Insert the pin down and up so that your pins are about a finger distance apart. You will continue pinning your sample all the way across to the other end. Do the best you can to keep everything even, but if you should have an extra Oh, this looks like a sixteenth of an inch on this side. There's just a little bit extra hanging over. That's okay. Anything larger than an eighth of an inch is a problem. So from there, you will bring your sample over to your sewing machine. Note the computer screen on the sewing machine that I am at a stitch length three. I'm using the number one presser foot. My needle is position so that it will end up in the air as I stitch. I'm going to use the 5 8 inch seam allowance, which is right there. I will make sure that my perpendicular edge of the fabric is right against the 5 8 inch line, and the parallel edge of the fabric is right along with the oval in the presser foot, right in there. I will go forward three stitches gently and then hold in my back button and go backwards all the way to the end of the sample. Now I will stitch straight ahead following the 5 eighths, taking my pins out as I go. If you need to stop to pull a pin out, you can certainly do so. When you get to the end, you're going to hold in the back button and go three stitches or so, and then let go and go forward. Lift up your presser foot and cut the strings on the side, or the thread, sorry. I'll use my scissors and trim the threads on both ends. Next, I'm gonna take it to the ironing board wake up my iron as they are all auto shut offs finger press open the seam then direction the point of the iron down the seam line pressing the seam opened always flip your sample over and give it another press on the other side if you need steam you can certainly press the steam button for steam. And that is your plain seam finishes sewing sample.